Hey everybody, today we're going to learn all about Saturn. <gasps> Saturn? That's one of the sun's favorite planets. <laughs> Why do you say that? Why? Well, it has rings on it. <laughs> if you like it, then you should have put a ring uh -oh. on it. Uh -oh. Can we please start the video? Who's ready to learn all about Saturn? But before we do, make sure you like and subscribe for more videos just like this. Ready to learn about Saturn? Well, then, let's put a ring on it. Boom! Saturn is one of the planets that orbit around the Sun in our solar system. Saturn is the second largest planet after Jupiter. Saturn is actually the sixth planet from the Sun and is known for its beautiful rings. Saturn is almost 850 million miles away from the Sun in the outer part of our solar system. According to scientists, the planet Saturn formed about four and a half billion years ago and was named after the Roman god of agriculture. One day on Saturn goes by in just 10.7 hours, but it takes 29 Earth years for Saturn to orbit the Sun. Saturn's diameter is about 74,900 miles. That is nine times larger than Earth. Hey, guess what? Although it is the second largest planet, Saturn is very light. It actually would float if it was placed in water. Saturn doesn't have a solid surface. Saturn is mostly a ball of hydrogen and helium. Since Saturn is mostly created out of gases and liquid, Saturn isn't very dense. In fact, Saturn has the lowest density of all of the planets. Saturn is nicknamed the ringed planet. It has more than 30 ring systems around it. Saturn has seven main rings located around Saturn's equator with spaces between them. Now, Saturn isn't the only planet with rings, but it definitely has the most beautiful and visible ones. The pieces that make up the rings of Saturn range from the size of a piece of dust to as large as a house. And these pieces or particles are made of chunks of ice and rock, which may have come from old moons that used to circle Saturn, but were smashed by comets and meteorites crashing into them. The rings extend thousands of miles out from the planet and are around 66 feet thick. And they can be seen from Earth, but you need a pretty good telescope. In the 1600s, when Galileo Galilei first found Saturn through a telescope, he wasn't sure what he was seeing. At first, he thought he was looking at a planet with handles, but it was Christian Huygens who first recorded that Saturn had rings. And to this day, scientists are still not quite sure about the origins of Saturn's rings. What we do know is that there is a distance of 3,000 miles between these rings, called the Cassini Division. Scientists believe that Saturn will lose its rings in about 100 million years. Hey, guess what? Did you know that at the time of this video, Saturn has 83 moons? 63 of them are already confirmed and named, but there are another 20 moons that are still waiting for their confirmation. Saturn's largest moon is Titan. Titan is the second largest moon in the solar system. Saturn's moon Enceladus is one of the most reflective objects in our solar system. Hyperion was the first moon discovered that wasn't round. At only 246 miles in diameter, Mimas is the smallest astronomical body in our solar system. Mimas is known to have a round shape because of its own gravity. Do you like pasta? Oh, we're gonna eat something? I'm hungry. Well, hey, guess what? Saturn's moon pan looks like the shape of ravioli. Moon pan? Oh, it's moon pan. 
Yeah. Looks like Rob. You're making me hungry. Oh, Saturn. I want to put a ring on you. And hey, guess what? The temperature on Saturn averages around negative 285 degrees Fahrenheit. Saturn has winds that can reach speeds of up to 1,100 miles per hour, making Saturn the windiest planet in our solar system. Well, hey, guess what? Now we all know a little bit more about Saturn. Thanks for watching. And don't forget to smash that thumbs up button. It really helps out our channel. It sure does. Make sure you subscribe. Bye. Bye.